Okay guys, so today I've got some more NAM 2020 coverage for you. In this video, I want to look at two sort of higher-end companies. So these two companies are Paletti Guitars from Italy and then Kiesel from here in the US. Now these two companies are very different, but they both offer some really beautiful, really high quality instruments. Now Kiesel, as most of you already know, this is uh, the company that used to be known as Carvin but they had some sort of changes in management and they've really just kind of reinvented the company in the past few years. And it's grown a lot and also I think in some ways the uh, market or the demographics that Kiesel is aiming towards has changed a lot. So it used to be much more of a traditionalist kind of company back when it was Carvin, but now it's a lot more about the, you know, the headless guitars and the whole gent crowd, that kind of stuff. Now with Paletti guitars, in the past few years, they've really made a name for themselves in terms of a very original approach to how they use materials in building the guitars. In many cases, they're using wood that is 100, 150, even 200 years old, and they're using some, some woods that don't normally get used in guitars, like olive wood or chestnut. These guitars really have a unique rustic style to them, and it really sets the guitars apart from those made by other brands. Okay, now I've got my footage up here, so let's go ahead and start out with some of the footage that I got from the Kiesel booth. Now one of the coolest things, and I think you can really see it here, is the variety in terms of the designs and the finishes that, that Kiesel offers. And they have all these amazing finishes. I, I think as far as finishes and colors, they're really at kind of the forefront of, of that element of guitar design today. Now obviously these guitars can be very expensive because a lot of them are all custom made, but they don't necessarily have to be uh, prohibitively expensive. I mean, you can still buy one of these guitars for, in some cases, a little over $1,000, maybe $1,100, uh, $1,200, $1,300, right in that range, which although that is certainly a lot of money, uh, it's still a realistic price point that it, you know, if somebody really wanted a guitar like this, they could save up for a while and eventually afford something like that. And because you're getting somewhat of a custom build, I mean, you're gonna have an instrument that really stands out from everything else. This is one of the areas at NAMM that really attracts a lot of people. So you can see there's a lot of people hanging out there. There's Angel Vivaldi hanging out, great instrumental guitar player. And of course, Kiesel these days is known a lot for doing the headless guitars. So, you know, not everybody is, is into that. I, I'm still prefer a traditional headstock myself. But I love to see guitar companies experimenting with alternative designs and, and getting new ideas out there. Now there's a lot of cool stuff here. Uh, guys, of this footage, what finish or design uh, that you see here do you like the best? I would love to hear what you think. All right guys, now I wanna show you some new stuff from Paletti Guitars. But real quick, as you probably know, because you've heard me mention it before, I'm really trying to grow the channel right now. So. If you guys enjoy this kind of content and you enjoy videos like this and you have not already subscribed, please consider subscribing right now. Okay, now I have a Paletti Stratospheric guitar that you guys have probably seen before on my channel. Really cool guitar, but I wanted to check out some of the new stuff that they're offering this year. Now what's great here is I was able to talk to Filippo, who's the manager there at Paletti, and he took me through, I did sort of a quick uh, interview with him, and he took me through a lot of the new stuff that they have available now. So I'll go ahead and roll that footage now and we can check it out. Hello everyone and welcome to NAM Show 2020. This is Filippo from Paletti Guitars Company and today I'm gonna show you some new models we bring at this NAM Show. So this is a limited edition guitars made out of 500 year old chestnut wood from wine barrels recovered in Leonardo da Vinci land in Italy. This is the serial number six. We just made 10 pieces with this wood. So it's really, really limited. The inlay are with the lilai, which is this icon of Florence and also recalls the golden radio studied by Leonardo da Vinci. As you can see, in occasion of his anniversary, 500 Leonardo, and uh, the limited edition, Il Giglio. 
Going down, we have the well-known four series, wine, loft, leather, and lounge. All of them made out of the same wood, 150 year old chestnut. And let me show you what we are bringing at this NAM show. Some exciting news, like the matching amplifiers with the new shape of guitars. This is the 127, like the name of an Italian car, and the 1112. What we did, it's matching the 6 watt amplifiers with the guitars. So with a real Italian leather top, which could be white, black, or red. This new sage green color, and the well-known surf green from the last year. Same chestnut wood, handmade pickups in Pauletti. All the hardware is handcrafted in Italy, in the in house. Shotgun shell knobs, three ways switch. And what we are doing in the latest part of the 2019, we are making the roasted maple necks on every guitar. And the roasted maple neck brings you a very stable neck um, also used on the Richard Fortus signature model we just introduced it uh, for the first time at NAMM this year a guitar completely designed upon Richard uh, custom specifications like the pickups and the electronic part there is a circuit inside that allows you to do funny things with the volume of the amp and the gain also, as I mentioned, we got the rusted maple neck in a reverse headstock with Richard Fortus laser engraved logo. All right. All right, guys. So now there's some really cool stuff there. Obviously, they're doing amps as well as guitars. Now, in all honesty, I mean, these are not cheap, inexpensive guitars. These guitars can cost sometimes three or four or more a thousand dollars. So it's definitely going to be an instrument that's more of an investment for you. But I think the key here is that if you're looking for something that's really gonna be unique and really stand out from other brands and do it in a way which just has a lot of quality to it, right? It's not just some weird, rare, goofy guitar. I mean, this is just a really, really, uh, a guitar made with pristine craftsmanship and a really interesting use of materials. If you want something like that, I mean, Paletti is, is it just like an obvious choice for something like that. All right, guys, now, if you saw anything in this video that you'd like to hear more about, please let me know in the comments section below. Or maybe you, you had something in there that was uh, really a standout favorite to you. I would love to hear about that as well. All right, guys, I've got more NAM coverage coming. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you soon.